the 2009 Jordan Brand Classic at Madison Square Garden. And in case you can't tell from the final score, there was some offense at the Garden tonight as we bring you back inside the world's most famous arena. And I would have to think, Jimmy, when you think about all of the college coaches watching their future stars play in this game tonight, mm -hmm. They had to be some pretty excited fellows around the country because there was some extraordinary offensive talent in this room. It's a deep class. It's a good class. It has a lot of size to it. It has a lot of speed. I think it showed up tonight in this basketball game. And uh, four guys in particular, I think, really jumped out. We talked about right at the beginning of the show how good John Wall will be as a college point guard and a NBA point guard someday. His speed is in the same level as Derrick Rose and Ty Lawson. It showed it tonight with six assists. Xavier Henry, another undeclared, unsigned uh, top five player, has his list down to Kentucky and Kansas. Attack the rim, but can really shoot the basketball. Those two guys are hard to guide at, hard to guard at either level. Derek Favors was terrific tonight. Co-MVPs in this basketball game with Renardo Sidney. Derek Favors going to Georgia Tech and Renardo Sidney, big fella in the white going to Southern Cal. I think they really benefited from the stylist basketball game. The guards got out and the bigs ran and uh, Favors and Sidney, soft hands, soft feet, quick feet. They can run rim to rim. They're learning how to play every possession, but they, they showed well tonight in the points category, but many guys showed me that they're going to be elite basketball players in college. When we look back quickly at John Wall and Xavier Henry, though, I mean, they're still the undecided, yep. undeclared pair. They might both go to Kentucky. They might join DeMarcus Cousins. They might join Daniel Orton there. I mean, are we looking at the next Fab Five, a team that if those two opt to go to Lexington and play with John Calipari, we'll just put them in the Final Four now, at well, least prediction-wise. Well, if Patrick Patterson and Jody Meeks were to come back and those two guys go, then certainly Kentucky jumps, I think, to a preseason number one. But don't count out the fact that Kansas is still locked in heavy with these two kids. If John Wall and Xavier Henry both go to Kansas, then Kansas would become the preseason number one. If they split apart, they're going to have to also split your votes. But those two guys are special and they're difference makers. Oh, a very special class in the 2009 Jordan Brand Classic. This year at Madison Square Garden, we saw star performances tonight. Again, our final score, 110 to 103. The black beat the white. That'll do it for tonight. Good night from New York City.